Hello world, I'm Siobhan Bonnie Legion and I want to talk to you about disclosure, uh, cosmic disclosure um, and full disclosure. I'm a California singer-songwriter, a multi-gender collaborative artist and I'm here to talk about disclosure, yes, unrelated to music, although everything's related when it comes to music. It's all related, it's all a journey. A um, little bit of background, I'm not really a religious person, I used to be a very active um, Christian. I'm in a small Christian community, kind of had a falling out with religion, not really religious. Um, I love science, um, I love people like uh, Michiro Kaku, um, Neil deGrasse Tyson and Brian Cox and uh, uh, Richard Dawkins and stuff like that. I love, I love science stuff, um, I, really t I took a keen interest in science. Um, but I also like stuff like ancient aliens and stuff. Um, I wouldn't call myself an atheist or an agnostic because I just don't like the boxes. I don't like labeling myself in a box. Um, I'm open, very open-minded. Um, um, anyways, um, I started watching a program here recently called uh, Cosmic Disclosure on a network called Gaia. Um, and I just wanted to talk about it because it's like completely blown my mind. Um, I, I've done a bunch of research online just trying to like look and see what everybody's thinking about this uh, cosmic disclosure. And I'm not finding a whole lot on it. Um, every time I watch something, um, I like to go straight to the skeptics and see what they say. And I haven't found anything good enough for me. But I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to tell you a little bit about this cosmic disclosure, if you haven't heard about it. Um, anyway, there's this guy, Corey Good. Um, first off, I don't, I don't get the impression that this guy is like lying about anything. I just, he doesn't, he just seems so, you have to watch it, he doesn't seem like a liar to me. You know, the host of the show, um, oh, what's his name, uh, David Wilcock. You know, he kind of has that conspiracy theorist vibe about him, you know, they kind of a little eccentric about things and stuff. Whereas Corey Good, you know, he just seems like an average Joe type of guy telling a story and so there's like a little bit of a trust feeling there with him, which is perplexing to the things coming out of his mouth. But um, supposedly he's worked for a secret space agency, he's been working for him, he was brought in when he was like six years old as like an empath, um, intuitive empath. Um, shown information and kind of trained up, you know, from, from six years old. Um, he's basically informing that there's like a whole secret space base behind the moon, on the dark side of the moon, and that we have colonies on Mars, all kinds of space technology that we've made contact with extraterrestrials. There's all kinds of extraterrestrials, like reptilians and the, the greys and basically all the conspiracy stuff that you guys have heard of over the years, basically everything, including all the cool Star Trek movie, uh, Star Trek series of shows like Star Trek and the movies over the years, Star Wars and, and, and all these sci-fi type stuff, you know, Stargate and stuff like, all this is kind of like true basically, everything's true, like all the stuff you've ever heard. And, and I know that sounds crazy, like, you know, even coming out of my mouth, I'm like, what are you saying? Um, Oh, it's just another one of these guys saying, you know, this stuff is true, you know. Um, but I, the way he puts it all together, um, in this day and age, with what's going on and all the lies we've been fed and all the stuff that we've, uh, you know, the, the new information that's been come out and, and with Snowden and all this stuff, uh, the new election and um, the world, <laughs> you can't trust anything, I do realize this. Um, and this part of the reason why I'm making this video is because, according to him, we have all this technology already. Humans already have replicator technology, um, technology that would boost us substantially into the future. Uh, technology where um, we could teleport from place to place real easy, just like that. Um, we have medicines. Um, that could heal people right now and I think if they're withholding this information um, <laughs> I mean do we put it past them? Do we put it past the government to not be withholding this kind of information from us? Um, I just I, I don't at this point in time I don't 
You know, I, I don't. I don't. You know, I think it's possible. With all the lies that have been stretched out over time, all the false things that we've been made to believe, through history, even religion in itself has just been this big false lie that's been pushed over us and something we have to believe in now society and... There's this great like thing as well that they talk about called um, Ubuntu or Ubuntu, the society that's like a no money based society. They touch on that in the, in the program Cosmic Disclosure about um, a, money be a, a society based on no money in the future and stuff and I, I love things like that. And I just think if we could get there now, if we could go there and there is this information out there and all these politicians and this government and these secret secret agencies or secret uh, societies that they call them, you know, out there are, are really affecting us in this way, you know, I feel like there's got to be something that we could do. We should demand it. We should demand it. There has to be some way that the people could stand up and just demand a full disclosure on whatever there is out there to be known. Even if you don't buy into this stuff or you think this guy's a crockpot or, you know, just like the flat earthers or one of these other people, you know, with some of the crackpot story that you think is completely crackpot. Um, there's too many lies out there, too much disinformation. We need a full disclosure. We need, we need to know what they know. Um, the Snowden thing was huge. This big break of information. I feel like we don't even have all that, do we? Do we? We don't even have all that information yet. And so, and why not? Why don't we? Like. We should have it now, like instantly. Who who has it and who's holding on to it? And this just perplexes my mind. Um, I want full disclosure. I want it now. Do we have? Is there is there a base behind the moon? Um, do we have proof of extraterrestrials? Um, lots of different races of extraterrestrials. Are there colonies on Mars? Um, do we have a replicator technology right now? Um, are there vaccines and um, cures that could be? curing our children that are dying right now of diseases. Um, yeah, pretty interesting. Anyway, watch this Gaia program called Cosmic Disclosure with this Corey Good and um, check him out. Trust me, you just, you just get a different energy, a different feel off of it. it. talks a lot about good stuff, you know, they could call it like hippie stuff or new ager stuff or whatever, you know. I. I hate labeling things, I really do, um, but I do like a lot of the message, you know, just letting go of hate and thinking positive about people and bringing up the vibration and we're all moving into this new part of the galaxy and this shift and, and all that and I don't just want to dismiss it, I just don't want to dismiss it and be like, oh that's just hogwash, you know, I just, it feels too good, <sighs> it feels too good and shouldn't we embrace the good things in life? Um, should we embrace those good ideas and try to make those and manifest those into what is? You know, let's let's have a society. Let's have a utopian society. You know, one thing one of the guy the guy of the, the Ubuntu society said. You know, we look at utopian society as a bad thing. You know, utopian is a bad word. You know, utopia that's a great word. You know, I want a utopian society. Can we get to a place where we can have a society without money, where we can just focus on? creativity and discovery and invention and stuff like that. That would be amazing. And um, So yeah, I think there's aliens out there. I do. I do. I think there's aliens. Go check it out, Gaia. Cosmic Disclosure. And demand full disclosure everywhere. We want the government to give us full disclosure. Everything. Tell us everything. Everything. We can handle it. They think we can't handle it. We can handle it. Full disclosure. All of it. Do we have a base behind the moon? Are we colonizing Mars? Are there aliens? Extraterrestrials? Reptilians? I'm trying to think of the other ones. The Greys. I don't know.